What's going on guys? It's Kurt from Kurt's Cottage. I'm working on this washroom reno here or washroom build. So the layout here, uh, shower stall in the corner here. The wall is going to go here. It's going to go across and to here. I can fit these tiles exactly right in and I don't have to cut anything. So first thing I want to cut this trim out. Okay, so I got to pull this piece of trim off and cut this piece of trim. Might as well just cut it out and then uh, drop in the subfloor. Let's get to it. Eight foot here. So, and basically it's right on the line of the flooring and, and then four feet there. So you want to set the height of your blade. I've drilled some holes, you see right here, from the basement, the joists are. So it's gonna be a joist. Let's hunt around for holes. So I'm about an inch over. So I've drawn the lines on where the floor joist should be. I start driving these screws home, floor joist. So I'm just laying things out now to get an idea of where I want everything. So what I'm going to do is cut in my holes for the drains now. Okay, let's just put the toilet back and see how that stays in here. Right, I dry fitted the tiles They're exactly where I want them to be. What I do is go down into the basement, my marker, I draw on the bottom of the tile the holes and just lift these up, cut my holes. So after it's mixed, you're supposed to let it sit for five to ten minutes. About an inch of water in the bottom of this pail, and that's how much you get. I watched a flooring guy do this. And all he did was just take the material and just slam it down to the floor.
there.